Hi everyone, welcome back. In this session, I am continuing the clock's topic. Let's see the first question in this session. See here, at what time in minutes? We need to find the time period in minutes. Between 3 o'clock and 4 o'clock. Here we need to find between 3 o'clock and 4 o'clock at what time? Both the needles will coincide each other. Both the needles in the sense both the hands. Hours hand as well as minutes hand will coincide each other. Coincide is nothing but the angle between. Coincide is nothing but the angle between minutes hand and hours hand is 0 degrees. So, first of all, let us take hours hand after that minutes hand. Hours hand and minutes hand. Angle between these two is 0. It means both are equal. H minus M is equal to 0 or else M minus H is equal to 0. As uh, right hand side value is 0, so obviously H is equal to M. So, first of all, what you will do is uh, exactly at 3 o'clock, uh, minute sand is at uh, 12th position. So, it doesn't move not even a single degree. So, it uh, its uh, angle is 0 degrees exactly at uh, 3 o'clock, right? Now, Exactly at 3 o'clock, our hand will move 90 degrees. Why? Because for every 1 hour, our hand will cover 30 degrees. Likewise, uh, 3 into 30. Now, we don't know after 3, what is the time. Let us consider that uh, x hours, uh, sorry, uh, uh, 3 hours, x minutes. After x minutes, uh, the hands are coincide each other. So, in that x minutes, the angle covered by hours hand, angle covered by hours hand is x by 2. Why? Because hours hand will move half degree for every 1 minute. For every 1 minute, our hand will move half degree. In x minutes, it will move x by 2 degrees. Whereas coming to minutes hand, whereas coming to minutes hand, it takes... 6 into x. Why? Because minute sand will move 6 degrees for every 1 minute. For every 1 minute, minute sand will move 6 degrees, whereas our sand will move only half degree. So, you can add these two first. 90 plus x by 2. This value is 90 plus x by 2 and this value is 0 plus 6x, which is nothing but 6x. Now, according to the given question, as the angle between minutes hand and hours hand is 0, so both are equal. Hours hand is equal to minutes hand. 90 plus x by 2 is equal to 6x. Now, from this, you can calculate the value of x. 6x minus x by 2 is equal to 90. And here it is 12x minus x, 11x by 2. 11x by 2 is equal to 90. That implies... This 2 goes to right side. X is equal to 90 to 0, 180 divided by 11. 180 divided by 11 minutes. After these many minutes, the two hands of a clock are coincide each other. But in the given options, the values are given in terms of mixed fraction. So you need to write in terms of a mixed fraction. Here it is 11. How many times it will cancel? You have to write here it is 1 time, after that uh, 70, 70 in the sense uh, 6 times, 16 into 11, 16 11 are 176 plus uh, remainder is 4, 16 4 by 11 minutes, 16 4 by 11 minutes, that is our required answer. After 16 4 by 11 minutes, the two hands of a clock are coincide each other. So, the answer will be option D is the right answer for this question. Whenever the hands of a, a clock are coincide each other, you need to remember that uh, hours hand uh, is equal to minutes hand. Why? Because the angle between those two is 0 degrees. So, directly you can take uh, H is equal to M. First, you can take this uh, 3 into 30 for hours hand plus X by 2. And you can add these two after that for minutes and 0 degrees and a 6x. Add these two. So that uh, after that you can equal hours and 
minutes and you will get the value of x but uh, remember that you must write the value of uh, x in terms of mixed fraction why because uh, in each and every problem he will mention in terms of mixed fraction he will not mention in terms of direct uh, fractions okay here the answer is option d let's move on to the next question see here at what time between 9 and 10 at what time between 9 and 10 o'clock will the hands of a watch be together together is nothing but angle is 0 degrees sir. again we don't know the time period but angle is given we need to find the time at what time let us take the time is uh, x hour 9 hours x minutes 9 hours uh, x minutes that is the time period at that particular time period the angle between uh, hours hand and minutes hand is uh, 0 degrees so follow the same structure as that of the common structure for previous problems which we are already discussed first exactly at 9 o'clock exactly at 9 o'clock our sand will move 9 into 30 degrees why because for each and every hour our sand will move 30 degrees for 9 hours 9 into 30 whereas minute sand is 0 degrees why because it doesn't start from 12 after that, still x minutes are left over. For every 1 minute, our sun will move half degree. For x minutes, it will move x by 2 degrees. Whereas coming to minute sand, for every 1 minute, it moves 6 degrees. For 6 minutes, for x minutes, it will cover 6 x minutes. Now you can add these two values, what you will get. Here, it is 270 plus x by 2. 9 into 30 that is 270 plus x by 2 whereas this value is equal to 6x now the question is uh, hands of a watch be together together in the sense angle is uh, 0 degrees whenever the angle between minute sand and hour sand is 0 degrees uh, then both are equal so you have to equate hour sand as well as uh, minute sand 270 plus x by 2 is equal to 6x that implies that 270 is equal to 6x minus x by 2 which is equal to 11x by 2 now you can cross multiply here it is 11x is equal to 270 into 2 that will becomes 540 and x is equal to 540 by 11 540 by 11 is equal to how much it is you just calculate it here 11 4 sir, 44 and 10 is the uh, left over 100 100 in the sense 11 9 sir. 11 9 sir, 99 still 1 is the remainder and the divisor is 11 49 1 by 11 540 by 11 is nothing but 49 1 by 11 minutes sir. therefore the required answer for this question after 49 1 by 11 minutes the hands of a clocks are together so that your answer will be 9 49 1 by 11 minutes 9 49 1 by 11 minutes this is the required answer for this question so your option will be 49 1 by 11 minutes past 9 o'clock option c is the right answer for this question guys i hope you understand the problems uh, related to uh, together problem right uh, thank you guys have a nice day